piece of bare cable about three feet long. I'll cut into the plastic insulation and pull it back carefully. And now I have a real nice piece of copper wire. And? You got everything? No, not yet. Well, get going! Metal tube, bare copper wire, head... for the direction finder. Very good. I'll build it up right away. But, first the theory. You take the receiver down to the coast, somewhere near the hotel. You turn on the radio, I'll set everything up and don't fiddle with it. Then you turn the antenna slowly and listen for where the Morse code signal is the loudest. Look at the compass and write down the bearings and degrees where the antenna is pointing. Good. I'll do the same here with my receiver. Then we'll plot the bearings on this here map. Transmitter's located where the lines cross, understand? Yes, sir. Good. Now let me get on with it. So, let's see. Got it. Back to the junk shop. And? Do you have a bearing? Yes, sir. Bearing at 73 degrees. Very good. My bearing is 90 degrees. Go on. Plot the bearings. Let's see. Your shop is here, and you had a bearing of 90 degrees. I was roughly here. This damn... Of course! What is it? A boat! <sighs> Boris has got a boat. That's why no one here knows him, and why the police didn't find him. The lines cross a few hundred yards from the coast, about two miles to the east. Good work. Now you need a boat. One of those lobster fishermen owes me a favor. You can use his. Uh... And what should I do with it? Sail out there, of course. And serve myself up for a fight with Reginald Boris on his ship? Didn't you hear the message? He plans on coming back into town again tonight, looking for you. That's what he said? Huh. I must have missed that. Well, go on, then. You don't get many opportunities to be a hero. I trust the police least of all. I'd rather get hold of the evidence of Angelina's innocence myself. And this time... It'll all be watertight. The cupboard looks like it's made of burl wood. But it can only be really a thin veneer, otherwise it'd be too heavy and expensive. Alright. A few maritime maps, tools, screws, and measuring instrument, and... Ah, a key! The photos of me. 
They're all from yesterday, me, me walking around town. This is me leaving the store. And here I am going to the hotel. And here, here I am with Angelina in the diner. Huh, that picture's been taken through the window. That Reginald fella must have been creeping about the whole time. Huh. I'll take them. Even though they'll probably be of no use. Cardboard folder. It looks really new. There's an A on the front. Huh. At the front of the folder is a small piece of transparent foil with lines on it. Strange. I'll take it with me. What else have we got here? Photos of Angelina. Some of them are clearly quite old. She can't be more than 13 or 14 years old in this one. Here she is as a kid. Hmm. Huh. A note. New York. Boston. Perhaps... perhaps that's her route? Yes. This proves that Boris has been following her for a while. I'll take the folder. It might fit. Let's see. The foil fits perfectly. It shows a route around the southern tip of Africa. The route is southwest, south, southeast, east, northeast, and northwest. Let's see. Wow, this is a cool model. Huh. What have we here? A final town. Willow Creek. I don't believe it. Why the hell does Reginald Boris have pictures on his computer of a place where my mother regularly receives money? Something very strange is going on here. I'll take it with me later. First, I need to find some more clues to what's actually going on here. What the hell? What links Boris with Willow Creek, and what's my mother got to do with it? The pictures of a big sailboat on a stormy sea. Maritime romanticism. There are hinges on one side of the frame. A safe. Hopefully it contains a few answers. Hmm. Here's a wind rose that you can turn. I guess the idea is the same as with Fuller's safe. But, unfortunately, I don't have a stethoscope with me to listen to the mechanism. catching symbol on it. Looks a bit Celtic. A tree or something. It's not gonna help me, though. A floppy disk. Labeled with Biddeford and today's date. That looks more like a clue. I should have a look at what's on it straight away. If the disk doesn't contain any critical information, then I have to keep searching. Either way, I should get a move on. I don't know how long Boris is gonna stay on land. What's wrong now? <laughs> 